Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to uninstall programs that will not uninstall on your Windows computer. So this should be a fairly straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by navigating over to this website I'm going to have in the description of the video. This is going to be a completely free application, and at least for what we're going to be using it for today. So you want to left click on the green download button on the left side here. And you want to make sure you select the free version on the left. So the only difference is, or at least the main difference that I've noticed is that it will do batch removal. So if you had multiple programs you wanted to remove at the same time, it would let you. But that's really not a big deal in my opinion, especially for what we're doing in this tutorial very likely. So I'm just going to select one of the two downloads on the left here. So you can either download the compressed file or just the application. It doesn't really matter. I'm just going to download the zip file format here just by left clicking on it one time. You just download it in a compressed file here. And I'm going to double click on the, on the entry to open it up. You're going to get a user account control window. You want to make sure it says verified publisher here. And you didn't click on something else. So once you have confirmed that your screen looks somewhat like this. Okay, so now in here, any programs you want to remove, you just want to left click on them. Right click on it once you've selected it. And then left click on forced removal. It's going to say, are you sure you want to perform forced removal of this program? Left click on yes. It'll begin scanning your computer for different information and perhaps what's on the computer. And you can see different information in the file system and the registry and whatnot. So once you confirm this is what you want to remove, left click on finish. And then I would recommend you guys restart your computer just for, to make sure it takes effect at that point. And that's about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.